This week's Matthew and Ali Variety Show has been brought to you by NAU Indo Italian Suppositories. NAU Indo Italian Suppositories. You put them in a NAU Indo, so something will come out of you Indo. Here you go, Mr. Ranker, sir. Sign this and I'll be on my way. Alright, thank you, buddy. This is great, man. Now I got my own llama. Llama! Llama! Hey, man, cut that out, man. That tickles. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Bye-bye. It's time for the show to start. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm on my way. Man, I'm going to tie you up, man. Leave her out here. Now, don't you move, man. You be good. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Oops, sorry. And now, here are the hosts of our program, Matthew and Allie. Hello everyone and welcome to episode 7 of the Matthew Nolly Variety Show. So, how does it feel to be back on the podium? Feels pretty good. I see you got a new tie too. Yeah, it's called a skinny tie. I got it at a store. It matches my suit better than the other one did. Looks very Buddy Holly-ish. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? So anyway, we... Lava! 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 I do believe we have a lot on the stage. Lava! I believe you're right. Uh... You know, you want to say your line so we can get on with the show? Hey, sorry. I'm at the show! Someone get along off the stage! Baba! Baba! Ladies, look at your dog. Now back at me. Now back at your dog. Now back at me. Is he me? No, of course he isn't. But he could smell like me if he'd stop using that old flea spray and switch to pooch spice. It not only gets rid of the fleas and ticks, but prevents him from smelling like a wet dog. Look down. Back up. How many of you actually do what I tell you? Raise your hands. I thought so. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. Now, where are you? You're on a boat with a dog who could smell like me. What's in your hand? Now it's in mine. I have a crab in my hand. In that crab are two tickets to the thing you love. Ow! That hurt. Anything is possible when your dog smells like a clean dog and not a dirty one. I am on a horse. Llama! Llama. Llama! 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 Hey, I'm Sammy. I'm Lola. Waiters are slow today, huh? Yeah. I ordered a veggie sandwich about 30 minutes ago and haven't seen it. Yet. What did you say your name was? Sammy. I just love veggie sandwiches without cheese. Oh, yeah. All those vegetables between two slices of premium bread? Makes you just want to take a bite out of one. Sound good to you? Absolutely. Wait, what? Welcome to Hollywood Smiles. My name is Dr. Ali Pooch, DDS. Where does it hurt? Oh, Dr. Pooch, my tooth hurts really bad. Can you help me? Don't you worry, pal. When I'm done with you, you'll feel like a million bucks. Just lay back in the chair and relax. This won't hurt a bit. First of all, we need to take a look in there and see what you got going on with them choppers. Hmm. That was corn on the cob. We got a lot going on in there, don't we, buddy? Haven't been flossing every day, have you, pal? No, well, not every day. Are you sure this won't hurt, Dr. Alley? Trust me, pal, you won't feel a thing. As a matter of fact, it will only tickle a bit. All right, I trust you, buddy. All right, Spams, this is Laughing Gas. 
give a little to you, then a little to me, then a little to you, and we'll get started here. <laughs> Spans, you okay, pal? Uh, wh wh where am I? You're still in the dentist office, pal, and I'm finished fixing your tooth. H how does it look? Take a look for yourself, buddy. What do you expect for three ninety nine? Nah, 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 nah. Hey, you! Stay away from my nah, sister! Nah, nah! Oh, trucks. Hey, what happened? That blasted Lama ate most of my sandwich. Whose Lama is that, anyway? I don't know, but it needs captured. Round up the crew. We're going to go Lama hunting. Okay. Beautiful tent homes. Yes, Watson, I must say. Very beautiful work, sir. Shall we retire for the evening? Yes, but shall. Watson, look up in the sky and tell me what do you see? I see millions of stars. And what does that tell you, Watson? Astronomically, it tells me that there are millions of galaxies and potentially billions of planets. Astrologically, it tells me that Saturn is in Leo. Theologically, it tells me that God is great and we are small and insignificant. Horologically, it tells me that it's about 3 a.m. Meteorologically, it tells us that we'll have a very good day tomorrow. What does it tell you, Holmes? Watson, you idiot. Somebody has stolen our tent. Oh. Caught the llama yet? No. I can't find him anywhere. Maybe you should leave out another one of your sandwiches. Already tried that. He's nowhere to be found. Well, um, I've got a stick to go to, so you're going to have to go mama hunting on your own for a while. Okay. Mama! 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 Hey, Tom. How do you catch a dragon? For the dragon net. Duh. <laughs> a.m. We received a call about a monster living in a nearby cave that no one has seen, but everyone knew was a dragon. My partner's name is Barely Surviving. Not a good name for this kind of job, but it goes with the territory. My name is Tom. Keeping Tom. I'm a private eye. 11.44 a.m. We arrived at the cave where smoke is billowing out of the front entrance and a sign reads, Danger. Dangerous dragon. Do not enter. If you do, it's your own fault. We warned you. My sign sounds very welcoming. Shall we enter? What shall? Sure is dark in here. Well, flip the switch, you goofball. Huh? Tom, we're in a cave. Fine, I'll do it. We'll all be. Just keep a lookout for anything suspicious. Sorry. I think we're getting close. Really? What gave you that clue? Just making an observation. Is somebody there? Did you say something? Tom, please say you said something. Something. Not that, the other thing. No, I didn't say anything. Must have been in my dandruff. Tom! Just kidding, Gee. I said somebody... Oh, hi there. Did you come to pick on me too? Ah! ah the dragon! dragon! Dragon? Where? Ah! The dragon! Save me! You gotta save me from the dragon! Uh, aren't you the dragon? Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I guess I forgot. <laughs> uh, so, uh, what can I do for you guys? Uh, well, we were supposed to capture you and take you back in for scaring the townsfolk. Me? Scaring them? They're the ones who come up here and pick on me. They yell and call me bad names all the time. They even threw baloney on my truck and ate up the paint job I'd just done. What kind of paint job? Flames. Figures. So I put out a sign outside to try and keep them away so I can live in peace by myself. It doesn't work all the time, though, and even my tail picks on me. Hey, stop that! Jeez, eat peeps! Anyway, so you see, it's them who need to be locked away. I only wanted a few friends, but they just ran away screaming when I came into town. So I decided to stay up here in this cave and them to leave me alone. Well, why don't you come back to headquarters with us instead? You can join a team. Why? Is it coming apart? Coming apart? Why, oh, yeah. Yeah, you'll fit right in, but a bing bada boom bada bim. You think? Definitely. With jokes as corny as that, come on.
So Nessie came part, to be part of the team and really helped clean things up. When you got a dragon on your side, you don't run into too much resistance. Especially with that tail of his slapping his way through. Hey, cut that out. All right, guys. Thank you very much for joining us on the show, and we hope that you enjoyed what you saw, despite it being a little bit of chaotic backstage. A little chaotic. That's an understatement. Stupid llama running around, creating all sorts of havoc. Do you think anyone caught it yet? Llama! 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 That would be enough. Llama! Apparently llama! Not. Can someone get this blasted llama off stage? <laughs> there you are, little rascal. Where you been? Llama! Llama, is this your llama? Man, that out, man. Yeah, man, that's my llama. Llama! Llama! Get, come on, man, let's get out of here, you little rascal. Come on. Lama, Lama, keep going, man, come on, keep going, keep going. Lama, Lama, Lama. That was weird. That was weird. Anyway, thank you for joining us, and we hope to see you again next time. All right, good night. So long, everyone. Bye. Accidents. How? Oh, I was reading a sign about not texting while driving and rear-ended the driver in front of me.